another planet to mimic Earth's conditions to favor survival of humans. You said that means what? That's what? It's called a terraform. Yeah. Mm, okay. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, so welcome to another video, guys. So today, Ashley will be showing us what this means to this girl. Oh, okay, I like it. Do you like it? Do you like your own painting? I do. Yeah. I did not when I painted it. Do I like it now? Me, I like it. <laughs> I really do like it, honestly. <laughs> so, let me tell you about it. Yes. So, in 2020, because, mm -hmm. yeah, mm -hmm. in 2020, um, Imperial College of London hosted the first, their first. <laughs> 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 global creative competition that's nice um for medical students around the world mm -hmm. so there are different entries from writing photography uh paintings drawing sculpt sculpturing that's what yeah sculpturing you know and that kind of stuff so um i had heard of it let's say a week before my friend ruby hi ruby if you'll watch this <laughs> hi ruby <laughs> <laughs> um sent it to me and she was like I think you should enter this competition I was like yes and um well me being the unfortunately great procrastinator I am uh, I decided to paint six was it like the day of the deadline ah. and I submitted it like, like I don't know six minutes before the deadline time or something so yeah that's what happened so anyway I painted this um a few hours before the deadline and I was like mm, I think this could tell a story yeah so um, in 2019 I went for a medical camp um, courtesy of Ma Makaya hi Makaya team if you like yes. we went to Shampole and this was kind of the state mm -hmm. of the of the community there so I thought I'd, I'd paint about what I saw and about how healthcare was there mm. and you know just kind of tell a story about it i will not get into the nitty gritties now so that this video is not too long but yeah so in short i did not win that competition and i got so mad first of all i wasn't even invited into the zoom call kina us you know people who are entering us up blah 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 were told um to watch youtube so i was like meet me in 2021 or 2022 i have to be in that zoom call and i have to be a finalist and i have to win i'm telling you i was like hey but let me tell you the entries the quality of entries that were given in that competition in 2020 i was just like i knew this is a joke so fast forward to 2021 yeah. So in 2021, I painted this painting. It took me two weeks. Not at all. I was refining, doing it, but you know, I was also juggling it with school. But yeah, I did this. Oh, I was checking if I painted well. Don't I say down? Um. Yes. And this painting's name is Terraform. As you can see, there's a soldier here with a kid. Um, it was during the, Afg the Afghanistan war. Mm -hmm. So, um, I also not get into the nitty gritties of, or the explanation yeah. of this painting. If you want it, um, it's pinned on my profile, on my inst Instagram art page, which is known as Nango. Michelle will link. probably link it. Yes. So this is Terraform. This is my favorite painting to date. Wow. Um, it's so meaningful to me. Um, and it has even the WHO. I think flag. I mean, it's not the WHO. The United. Oh, it is. See the oh, United sorry, Nations. United Nations. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So beautiful. May like it. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, and this one. So this I painted. It's so beautiful. In 2021. So beautiful. Let me just confirm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> painted it last year. Um. It was during a period that started wearing head wraps a lot. Because, mm. you know, I like head wraps. So I was just like, ah, let me paint this. Um, I looked at a page that sells amazing head wraps known as Farm Jam um, by Finding Paola. And I was like, yeah, I'm gonna paint something funky, something 
beautiful of course it had to be a black girl yeah and yeah her the eyeliner is good though thank you and i'll see how it looks like with me used on that movie for i want to dance with somebody really? yeah, the movie just came out I and we it. should watch it and it just looks like her oh yeah so i was thinking it's giving which new stone vibes i link the movie and the card yeah yeah this is one of the paintings of so Chicago. beautiful i really love it i it's refuse so nice. to sell it it's mine even me i would refuse to sell it <laughs> and this ah oh, i love this oh so, my god <laughs> honestly mm-hmm. so i also really enjoy painting landscapes um unfortunately i don't have my favorite landscape which is known as njoro dreams um which is a painting of a place i love in joro um which i unfortunately don't even know, know the name but hey <laughs> we move um so this i saw a picture on pinterest and i was like i want to paint this and i did so beautiful mm. yeah it's giving me like this one it's like sound of music vibes mm. it's so, for this, so beautiful this one This is a combination of Mount Kilimanjaro. I should have asked you guys to guess. But <laughs> this is Mount Kilimanjaro. <laughs> And I put a small hill there. The vegetation however is not um Mount Kilimanjaro's kind of semi arid vegetation. This is very green and florally. Yeah. Uh the wall though was inspired by a lodge. Yeah. that I saw in a photo on Pinterest. So I was just like, let me combine elements and give it a twist. So I did and that's that. It's so beautiful. Even the road, <laughs> like the way the road is looking like leading up to mm-hmm. maybe a house or something. It looks like a nice picnic area. I feel like because if you put yeah. the wall, yeah. it looks very like, now it's not even like animals. I feel like you put it in such a way that you can tell maybe it's leading to somebody else's house yeah or you're leaving somebody else's house so it would be it looks really really nice okay. it's giving me sound of music vibes that one and oh, this one oh i love that movie i have a question about this other one which one this one this one yeah like i like how you made the clouds like to it seems like they are moving do you see that yeah like the brush strokes you can feel like when you look long enough like you can tell that like the wind is pushing the clouds, clouds yeah. and also like the movement of the vegetation just on the mound as in mm-hmm. i re- this painting speaks to me i really love it and Aww. also like the yellow on the tree over there the mm-hmm. shadows mm-hmm. and I also appreciate this detail mm-hmm. you put here just on the shore where mm-hmm. there is the boat mm-hmm. i think it's really really beautiful to be honest thank you yeah i feel like you achieved what you wanted with this one i, I really like you're really proud of this one yeah yes It's smart <laughs> i'm like I'm, i'm like just give you a few years i feel like utakuwa in that realism like era oh thank you for sure it's so beautiful that's the aim guys <laughs> and then the song oh my god <laughs> oh girl so this was actually my first ever portrait it's not exactly mm-hmm. portrait but yeah um and ah uh, i'm trying to remember who was trying okay i remember um the head wrap was still inspired by farm jam as i said They you should link them here amazing yes. head wraps they have amazing head wraps i love their business the earrings as well shots kiss from jam wow everything is just from jam then yeah i i just achieved this with a rough brush mm. and just dab it to my mixed um golden paint with maroon oh it's a nice just color bit, you know but that sort of gold gold feel yeah if you're seeing it it looks like rose gold. gold yes exactly mm. yeah and plus also i like also like the shadows you achieved also on her neck mm. and her cheek as well because mm-hmm. you see it's the shadows are falling from the forehead mm. to the cheek which is really nice yeah. i like her black lipstick and also you can see that there's a shadow for the 
earring. earring just the back yeah. and also the edges of the hair her hair is really pretty <laughs> and also the depth of the color with the fabric mm. in terms of like the clothes and then here it's lighter here it's darker mm -hmm. i really like her lipstick though i feel like it's good you chose black mm. or like a dark brown yeah rather than a red because yes. it would have conflicted with what the was teams. happening yeah yeah yeah, yeah. When I you actually did try. You try. did. I did, and I was just like, no, this is not gonna work. work. So then I changed it to a dark brown. Oh, that's nice. I really like it. Thank and this one was for 2021. Yeah. That was yeah. nice. I like you how you sign. Let me show you. Maybe you can lift it up. You see how. So she always signs her name with the date. Yeah. So that the why year. why over oh, the year mm -hmm. why did you say you date it like that? Um, so that I can trace and track my progress over time yeah and just like this it's al almost like the shade of and color of your hair because <laughs> she did her own hair guys she did her own hair <laughs> we I, tried. I, I, we I like it it looks good it looks good i Thank like it <laughs> So you can close the video for us okay guys thank you so much for um watching this video in fact if you got in this far you're a legend round of applause for you thank you so much because <laughs> oh, it's my first time doing something like this so i'm a bit shy um but thank you and uh please continue supporting michelle as she you know continues to progress as an artist Supreme, <laughs> that I to tell her like she's so phenomenal, and um, yes, please also support me as I continue in my painting journey. Yeah, and also of late as an illustrator. Yeah, because she did. Uh, I'll, I'll show you some really nice pictures of what she did, even on like album covers and stuff. Yeah. So I'll link everything so yes. that you guys will see. Yeah. So God bless you. Um, happy holidays. Happy New Year. Yeah. And have an amazing, amazing 2023. Yeah. Bye.